What do you get from number one in the world rewards in squad battles? Wait, can someone put the smoke out? Jesus Christ. The best squad battle packs are about to be released for my good friend Chipmunks. His team is this. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Number one in the world rewards, and obviously that team is a big reason why. I mean, it's incredible. Unbelievable. What kind of players you can get in this game right now. To have a quick look, guys, what is Ronaldo's price on the market? Has it gone? Wow, he's actually really gone down in price. Wow. 600k, lost that right there, Ronaldo. Root Hullet is unbelievable. I've used some of these cards on team. Six foot three, I mean, come on. He's just one of the best players in this game. Ronaldo's incredible. However, I can't help but feel like it's kind of money wasted. You could just go and get Eusebio. Probably will score as many as well. Um, Messi is one of the best players in this game. Once Neymar gets a few special cards, I, I can imagine he'll be in this team. I think he could get someone like Hyung Min Sun and score as many as Ronaldo. Hyung Min Sun in this game, guys, is crazy. But yeah, I actually just completed his David Villa SBC for him. So maybe David Villa could be a great player in this game. You never know with David Villa. Kind of do wish, guys, he had five so week. for anyway, you are here for squad battle rewards. So number one in the world rewards are here, guys. Last week, I believe we did a video on number one in the world rewards as well. So today we're doing it again with a different player. So make sure to follow my good friend, Chip Monks. He's a really nice guy. And yeah, there's actually a few of them who play um, and grind their way to get number one reward. And number two, I believe, was one point off in squad battles. Not joking. I think it was one point off. We'll go and check that. Anyway, as you guys can see, two ultimate packs. 100,000 FIFA coins, two rare mega packs. Remember, they are tradable. That is 310,000 coins worth of rewards. To let you guys know, and to let you guys know why this is actually really interesting. So, show previous result. There was one point in it. One point. Unreal. Also, I need to clarify, guys. Is there a difference between number one? There is a difference between... Wow. I did not know that. I thought you got the same rewards. It's actually very different. So, you get 12.5k less for finishing number two. You get about... Uh, how many is that? About 110k less in pack value as well. That's actually a big difference. I did not know that. Right. Let's get into the packs, guys. I mean, if there's one player he should get, comment down below. Should it be someone like Hyung Min Sun? Let's find out. Also, I hope you like the Inter Milan jersey. It's an amazing, really is an amazing shirt, this one. First pack, and it's a pre-order pack. And he gets no boards. No surprise there, guys. These pre-order packs give him nothing. Um, only good thing is he'll get some coins off of that, so that's, uh, that's always good. Right, rare gold pack. Let's... Begin the boards. Can we get a board? Oh, my days. Like, am I the only one who just doesn't get great pre-order packs ever? My best one ever is probably Thomas Muller or Di Maria. Anyway, he gets uh, a CM to cam. Nothing else there. 2.7k, man. Oh, wow. Right. Mixed player pack. I do not expect much from this. At all. And I was right to not expect anything. Yeah, we need some better pack look right now, guys. We don't really get much there. Um, I'll keep that silver for him, actually, just in case he sells on the market or whatever. Right. Time to get some boards in this video, guys. Can we do it? Number one in the world rewards. That is not a board again. I'm skipping it, man. Like, I'm very surprised he's not got a board yet, to be honest. At least he does get some... Uh, potential League SBC gems for uh, squad building challenges. Right, now time for the big packs. I'm thinking we're going to get a board in this one. That's my prediction. We do not. Oh my god. This has been insanely bad. <laughs> okay, so he gets um, 
nothing from the David Veer SBC. Well, that's amazing, isn't it? 4.5k, guys. Now time for the big packs. Question of the video. For finishing number one in the World and Squad Battles, what should you get as pack rewards? Should it be this? Two rare mega packs and two ultimate packs, or should it be four ultimate packs and four rare mega packs? What do you think? Okay, the first big one is opening, guys. Rare mega pack number one. It is finally aboard. Let's see. It's not going to be a walkout, though. What nation? Greek? That's at least someone decent. He gets Jimenez, who actually will be worth, like, maybe 15k, according to this ridiculous transfer market. So, Jimenez... In a pack, in number one in the world rewards, guys. 12.5k right there for him. He'll go for that. So, yeah. In the first one, we get Jimenez, who... Oh, hold on. And Babu, does he sell? Guys in the comments, does he sell? Damn, he doesn't sell. It's very tempting to do a weekend league with, like, a 50k team because some of the players you can get right now are crazy. Go on. Be boards. First in the world squad battle rewards. Get you two boards in a row. Not a walkout, though. Dutch. That's probably not going to be anyone good, that. Uh, oh, hold on. My bad. I love this guy. Sorry. <laughs> Mine Alden. 84. Again, it might be like 7K. But, you know, you are looking for better players than this. Wine Alden. 9,000 coins. No, he's not. He's actually about that. 6K will sell right now. Wine Alden, guys, will be on the market for that. Um, yeah, 5.3K. Uh, okay, so we need better pack luck for Chipmunks than this. Number one in the world rewards, guys. He is selling Hyung Min Sun for 1.8 million. Let's see. Will we get an icon? Will we get anything? <sighs> I'm nervous. It is a board. Be a walkout. Oh, it's an inform, but it's not a walkout, guys. Ultimate pack, Danish. Right mid. Is a Skov? I think it's Skov. Well, 81 informed Skov from an ultimate pack is what he just got. Uh, that is disgustingly bad, eh? So Skov will go in the market for like that, 10.5k. Uh, yeah, that is seriously bad. I don't think he got anyone else. No, not really. Wow, so 12k discarded right there, guys. Now time for the final first in the world Squad battle rewards. Pack opening. It's opening. It is, thank God, a board. Please be walkout. Oh, wow. Wow, guys. French left back. Digne from an ultimate pack. Ultimate packs, in my opinion, should be at least 85 overall. That should not be allowed. Oh, my God. That's fascinatingly, disgustingly, atrociously bad. Digne, Emre Chan, Angelino. That has to be one of the craziest ever squad battle rewards for finishing first in the world. Can I just show you guys his squad again? Because I need to clarify this. They've grinded so much to get first in the world rewards and he gets Digne and Inform Skov. Skov, guys? Like, what? What is that pack look? On a real level, what is that look? Also, quick side note, I think he... Oh, no. I thought I got him in a pack. Um, we did actually open some icon packs for Chipmunks, and they did get Rio Ferdinand. So I'm actually going to try Rio out. Um, also, another thing to note about his team. So when I did, when I did use his team, he had... Who was it? Um, yeah, Ede Militao. I want to compare Ede Militao to Rio Ferdinand and then obviously to Van Dijk. I mean, if you look on paper, you'd think Militao would be third, right? But I mean, he's, he really is a meta centre-back again, this FIFA man. He's six for one with those stats. And obviously with a, maybe even, yeah, once in game. In fact, once he's in that position there, what is his uh, stats looking like? Yeah, look at that. 92 sprint speed compared to what? What does what's Rio saying, guys? Hold on, let's um give him the right camera. Style. Let's give him a guardian one there. Um, in game, yeah, he is going to be just crazily good in game, man. 
But yeah, there were his new squad battle rewards, guys. Thoughts on that out of 10? <laughs> I imagine you guys are going to rate that very lowly in uh, Ultimate Team out of 10. But that is Van Dyke's stat. So what do you think is the best option there? I really want to give Rio a try. Just see what he can do. In fact, oh my god, if he sold all these chemistry styles, guys, he could legit get so many coins. Wow. Oh my god, he could get so many coins, it's unreal. You know what, I'm actually going to give Rio an anchor chemistry style. I want to get, I want to get him as many, as much pace as possible. That would be really interesting to try his card out. Right, that is his team, guys. First in the world, squad battle rewards are done. Let me know your thoughts on that out of 10. We need better rewards for the next squad battles.